Hi guys, welcome to a fun new minimalistic Monday design. For those of you who are new to my channel, I'm only allowed to use up to two different nail polishes in this series. In today's tutorial, you only need one color and tiny pom-poms, preferably in a matching color. Let's begin by applying a base coat on each nail. Then go ahead and apply your base color. I went for white. I like to seal in the nails with a regular top coat before using any matte top coats. The pom-poms aren't shiny, so I didn't want to have a shiny background. So let's add a matte top coat. Now on to the pom-poms. I got mine in a Japanese dollar store in Japan. I hope you can find similar ones on the internet or in your local craft store. I was thinking to cut the pom-poms in half, but as you can see, this didn't work out. As you can imagine, such 3D items are hard to secure, so I wanted to try out a few methods in this video. Let's see if a nail glue, regular gel, jewelry gel or a all-purpose glue will secure the pom-poms the best. First up is the nail glue. I don't think that it will last very long with this method. I'm more confident about the gels. So here's a regular soak off gel and here's the jewelry gel. Let's cure them and then use the last product which is the all purpose glue. While the different glues are drying, here are some shots of the complete design. I think this is super cute and great for a party or photo shoot. I don't think that this is wearable though. I mean, how would you wash your hair with those nails? Let's see which method worked the best. I think nothing will secure the pom-poms very well because they are fluffy. The only secure way I can think of is to add a blob of gel and sew the pom-pom into the gel. Anyways, first I'm gonna slightly wiggle the pom-pom. Whoops, the gel one is already coming off. I'm gonna repeat wiggling on each nail but this time harder. So both of the gels I used didn't work. The nail and all-purpose glues are definitely the winners. I didn't have issues removing both of these glues but I recommend to use the nail glue since this is made for the nails and could be safer than any other glue. This was a bit a different minimalistic Monday tutorial than usual. Let me know if you enjoyed it by leaving a comment, thumbs up and a sub. Here are some more of my previous minimalistic Monday designs, so check them out if you haven't watched them yet. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!